Hello everybody, welcome back to Drunken Sailor. If you remember me, I'm Bill. I am the Drunken Sailor and uh, oh, excuse me, that is so good. Hot summer night and I'm feeling very tropical so I'm thinking go to the Caribbean and I wanted a, a, a good classic cocktail. So I came up with a daiquiri. And as good as this daiquiri is, And it's very good. The neat thing about it is, is it's a very versatile base to a cocktail and you can make all kinds of different daiquiris. And that's what we did over here too, is, is I made a different one. We have our classic Cuban daiquiri and we have what's called with a little bit of a tiki twist to it, a Fasanova. And I gotta tell you, that one's pretty darn good too. So, if you're ready, get behind a bar. Let's go. It's time. Let's get pouring. So the two cocktails are very, very similar in nature. There's only one ingredient difference and a little bit of, on, the, on the juices. So we're going to make them side by side. First off is with all daiquiris, you use simple syrup. The original daiquiris, they actually just poured sugar over ice. And they're both going to get one half an ounce of simple syrup. That's one to one. Next, we're gonna use lime juice. Freshly squeezed because we know fresh is best. And here's where we get a little bit of difference in here. The Fashionola is gonna be one half ounce of that freshly squeezed lime juice. Our traditional daiquiri is gonna use three quarters ounce of lime juice. Next, we're gonna use white rum. Now you can use any kind of rum you like. I was very tempted to use my Cuban rum because it is a Cuban drink, but we're just gonna stick with some Bacardi uh, white rum here. And they're both gonna get two ounces of rum. Like I say, everything is pretty much the same, but now we're gonna use our Fasanola syrup. This is a tiki syrup that uh, Don Beach, down to Beachcomber Beach, Comer Beach uh, developed in the early 30s. And that is going to go three quarters of an ounce of the Fasanova. And there's passion fruit in there, there's strawberry in there. And you'll see the recipe for that Fasanova down below. If you're liking what you see so far, don't forget to hit that little button over there that says subscribe. We need the subscribers, folks. You always put some ice in here. And now we shake them. Everybody loves a good stereo. I've had two glasses that have been chilled. They're filled with ice. We're going to get rid of that ice. Now we're going to pour. First pour is our classic daiquiri. The next pour is our tiki tinted fasanola. All we have left to do is garnish folks. For the fasanola being a nice tropical drink, we're going to put in a pretty flower in there. For our classic daiquiri, we are going to use a lime. And there you have today's daiquiris, Fasanola and a classic. Thanks for joining us.